Greetings, air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Welcome to Sun, Moon, and Stars Intuitive. I am Oracle of the Ether. Now let me turn this up. So I hopped on to give you your etherology check-in. You might want to check the other signs. Earth signs have already been posted. This is intended to be a real quick reading. So I have already cleansed, meditated, and called in the appropriate energies. Now this may as well as pre-shuffled and pulled uh, the decks. Now, this may apply to you or someone in your sur surroundings, a child, a co-worker. It may even apply in reverse. Keep that in mind. It may have already happened for some of you. It may be coming up. Now, the air signs. I took the initiative to pre Pull your card. Now, this is talking about surrendering your addictions. Now, this could be to people, places, or things, even uh, ways that you view yourself um, or others. I feel like with the mask on there, um, someone is wearing a false mask. Um, maybe it's someone is perceiving you as being false or holding something back or something are you thinking that of someone else now here we have the passion card i don't know if i mentioned this in the other reading but these are crystals that may be helpful for you at this time if this reading applies so this is the ruby record keeper now this is telling me that someone is obviously doing some type of investigation it may be um obsessive in a in a in some sort of manner or you may be working in a field where you do a lot of an investigation okay so what this is telling me is you're looking for clarity um, for some of you this is having to do with a self uh worth issue um you know, it might have something to do with your spiritual growth, uh, discipline. It could also have to do with uh, mind, body, and spirit, if you have, are familiar with the Trinity. And also, um, here we have your spiritual guide. So, there's someone trying to connect with you spiritually, okay? For some of you, it may even be physically. But this is talking about having courage and having faith, because something is in the workings for you and you is it's you're going to have to be patient because this is surrounding some sort of partnership. Now, this could be in finances, uh, speaking a career or relationship. All right. So here we have the grounding card, smoky quartz. You're going to need to uh, ground yourself for this adventure because it might um, require require some traveling for some of you. OK, um, I feel like you may have been um, exerting some of your energy, uh, you know, to others and for others, uh, you might need to pick up and um, get out on the project that you set out to get out on. OK, this is talking about religious factors. OK, your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual paths. OK. Um, this is telling me that for some of you, this is the, the the way you do things. You may have gotten into a pattern where you uh, obsessively do things. Um, you know, it may be surrounding, um, you know, sex. Okay, you may have some addictive. Um, you know, personality surrounding sex because it's a lot of sacral and um, that's my son in the back. <laughs> sacral and uh, heart chakra issues, I feel like. Um, so here we have the uh, father card. Now, what this is telling me though, this could be you just being um, too much in your ego. OK, and taking on that masculine authority, kind of abusing your control. Other this beliefs ha, belief system has something to, to do with your father or surrounding your father. OK, that's why, uh, you know, we have the surrender, your fear of change. Now, this may 
has something to do with the earth sign reading because I believe this came up. All right. Um, we have trust twice. Okay. You'll see. All right. So here you have a fear of trusting people. Um, so you might come off a little bit promiscuous in other people's eyes. You might have a fear of uh, commitment or this is the way someone is viewing you or you are viewing someone someone else right okay you have the surreal uh, surrender surreal surrender your fear of intimacy now i'm going fast on this reading because it's designed to be quick so if you get in this reading and you want a more relaxed reading spread out reading I do those for monthly, so go ahead, like, comment, and subscribe. Also, if you're feeling led to donate, the Cash app will be in the description box below. All right, so here, I'm seeing that we have some trust issues, okay? So this may have something to do with the reason why um, you have this addictive personality or you're dealing with someone that have an addictive personality. This may feel like a karmic cycle, like this person doesn't trust you or you can't trust this one, um, uh, this person. Okay. This has something to do with childhood. This person may need to recapture their, um, their innocence. I'm getting for someone, some, something may have happened in this person's childhood okay however you have uh your angels your guys your way shores allah uh yahweh whatever it is yashua whatever it is you believe in is trying to open up your heart to passion okay um spark you know open up your eyes to new creative ideas uh and ways of thinking i'm getting okay because we have the saturn card here and we also have taurus which is telling me that some of you are stubborn to a change you may be not wanting to commit or someone may not want to commit they may have seen their father you know in the past uh, do some things and they may have developed you know some addictive characteristics from their father especially with the saturn energy here some of you could be dealing with the capricorn or aquarius but i do feel like there is some uh, uh, restrictions surrounding you right now um, possibly due to the quarantine you may have a problem with being alone and you might have to address that okay and so yeah with this healing family issues here i really do believe that this has something to do with the patriarch with the father you know with your father's side yeah let go of control issues most definitely here with this father card here and this religious factors is telling me that this person you know is very ego driven um you know very passionate but um, to advance to the next level, you or the person you're dealing with is going to have to deal with their addictive personalities, whether it be um, people, places, or things. And here we have the surrender addictions card. And as you can see, we have a deception. So someone is keeping something um, behind or holding something back regarding their passion it could be that this person wants to move on or someone wants to move on from you this person could also just you know be high uh hiding a third party for some of you and you might have um your intuit your intuition might be trying to tell you that this is happening however you may have some fear of change okay and you're needing to regain your passion back and know that you could uh, drop this false mask, okay? And this is a cycle that you have to learn. You have to learn to to have trust and faith and also have uh, courage because you're going through a pattern where you, you know, you're being disciplined, okay? It's about, this is about your spiritual growth, okay? Um here we have the earth card. So this is speaking of ask the elements of earth for grounding, stability, and strength in times of chaos. So some of you could be dealing with the earth sign, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. However, you're needing to get grounded. Okay, so some of these um, 
rubies and crystals might help you with that so we have the record ruby keeper and we have the celestine the spiritual guides all right but most definitely someone is trying to get some insight on this particular situation okay um right here we have the delight okay i feel like the i don't delight it yeah this is the delight card for me okay this is uh speaking about acquiring deeper knowledge okay um and you know this is also talking about superficial things okay um, and very much with the religious factors and the father card. This is someone that is only looking for surface things. So you might be getting some hints, hints from your spiritual guides, your higher self, saying that it's time for you to change this destructive pattern. Either you are the person you're dealing with, right? Because we have all this surrender to trust. Trust. Trust that, you know, this change is you know, beneficial for you. Someone is definitely spying or someone is definitely in law. All right. Um, yeah, the athlete. Okay. So I feel like the spirit is trying to tell you to uh, surrender those limiting beliefs about yourself. Okay. Some of you are healers. And so you're going through this transition because you have to learn um, what is needed to heal yourself so you can heal others. You know, you could be dealing with a Taurus again, but this is saying to, you know, <laughs> um, money, you know, maintaining the status quo, love and all the material things. There's something that, you know, um, is elusive here. Something that needs to be addressed in your subconscious. You could also be dealing with the Cancer or a Pisces. Um, however, this could have something to do with your mother, your child's mother. Okay, some of you may be dealing with the Scorpio. If not, this is about transformation and healing. Okay, um, and change with this Uranus card. All right. <sighs> Okay, some of you may be dealing with uh, most definitely a love, charm, and passion, and Saturn. Some of you have been working out of your lower chakras, meaning you're using sex as an escape. And, and the spirit is trying to get you to end that, that cycle, okay? It's telling you here to listen to divine wisdom and joyful learning uh, and, and, and joyfully Learn life lessons. You're being you're being shown something. You're being shown something. You're right. <laughs> With this Mars here, this is about sexual uh, energy. It's most definitely you could be dealing with the Aries or a Scorpio. Very aggressive, very driven, very powerful. This is masculine energy. Something is needing to be transformed about the way you view love. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this reading and I'll talk to you later, air signs.